Hi, this is Scott from Classic Motors Workshop. Today we are going to be assembling this uh, timing tensioner gear into this uh, timing chain on this MGB 5 main bearing engine. Right, so the first thing we are going to do, I'm going to take the tensioner, I'm going to take the spring, I'm going to take that, I'm going to turn it in, and then with our Allen key, we're going to lock it into place. Once it is locked into place, we're going to slide it into the body. We're going to put the plate over. And then we are going to put the lock plate on, put the bolts through. Right, and then we're going to slide it all into place, like so. Once we've got it all tightened up, uh, we will tab, pull the lock tabs back over, um, which I will do just now. I don't have the uh, prior with me. Um, and then the second thing we're gonna do is we are going to unlock the tensioner. And as it's unlocked, now the spring pushes it out, and it is now in place. Again, we're going to put its lock tab on, and we are going to fill up. We're going to put its little screw in to stop any rubbish or whatnot getting in there. And like all of these little fiddly things, it's quite tight. And uh, again, I will get my pry and I will knock over the lock tab and then it's all in place. Um, let me do that quickly. I don't want to strip that. I can always use a flat screwdriver and just bend that over and it's done. This will need a pair of pliers and it will be done, but there we go. And that chain is now tensioned nicely. And when we turn the engine, there is no slack in the chain. It's holding it nice and tight. So it will take up any slack anywhere. And that's it. And that's how we do this job.